Hi there. I love fresh flowers and one of the treats I get for myself every week is a nice bouquet of roses from Trader Joe's and I always feel really lucky that I can do that. But you know, after a couple of days, things start to wilt, right? This is actually, um, I think these roses are two weeks old, if you can believe it. I'm pretty diligent about cutting them and changing the water, but I wanted to show you what I do when it kind of gets to this point. It doesn't look terrible, but it looks a little tired. So what I do is um, take out the roses. <clears throat> I pluck off all the old petals that are starting to die, right? So then you get a pretty nice looking fresh rose, mostly. I'm gonna give the ends a fresh trim. I haven't done that yet. And then I'm gonna pop them in a teapot. They look so cute when they're clustered all together. Okay, let me show you. You're gonna end up with a ton of rose petals, right? And you might be thinking, well, I don't wanna waste those. I mean, they're they're beautiful, and they are. Um, but sometimes, you know, a rose is too far gone to really save. So what I would encourage you to do is just take off the petals, right? Let all the petals dry out. And then what you can do with these, right? I mean, you could obviously make confetti for your garden, which is one of my favorite uh, things to do with rose petals. And uh, I know that's not uh, preferred by my gardener, but uh, who I feel very lucky to have, so I don't wanna make him mad. But what you can do is um, let these dry and um, they dry, you know, fairly pretty colors. So you can put them um, around a gift and wrap it with cellophane and that looks really fun. You can also chop them up and add them to um, some kosher salt with a little bit of um, almond oil or um, essential oils and make a kind of a scrub. There's so many things you can do. So don't throw these pretty things out. So one thing I realized I really should show you is that I do something a little bit um, different when I am, um, before I cut my roses, right? So I kind of, I, I pluck off all the petals and then I bunch them in my hand before I cut them. And you want to kind of make a nice round bunch. And I would fix that one that's sticking out, but um, my hand is holding the phone. So, you know, try to get it into a nice shape that you like, then cut it, then put it in your teapot. So doesn't that look better? I think they look a lot healthier and fresher. Now I could have plucked off even more, but you know, honestly, I, I don't mind a little bit of dings on the edges. I like to have some full volume. So now I've got my petals and today we're just gonna do some garden confetti. Baby, we're gonna do some garden confetti with the roses? What do you think? So cute. Indy, you come see garden confetti? Oh, who wants garden confetti? Who likes the garden confetti? Boydo! 